What to expect during your neurological claim exam. If you're a veteran who has a disability due to your military service, you may decide to submit a disability claim with VA. Neurological disorders are diseases in the brain, spinal cord, and the nerves that connect them. There are more than 600 diseases of the nervous system, such as brain tumors, epilepsy, Parkinson's disease, multiple sclerosis, and migraines. If you've submitted a claim to VA for one of these types of disabilities, you may be asked to come in for a claim exam, also sometimes called a Compensation and Pension, or CNP exam. Claim exams help VA gather or confirm medical information needed to make a decision on your claim. What happens during your exam will depend on what medical evidence is already included in your claim application, such as your medical records. Exams can be different for everyone. Exams may only last a few minutes or may take longer. Remember the length of your exam is based on what additional information VA needs. The length of your exam is not a determining factor in your claim decision. Wear loose, comfortable clothing to your exam in case you need to move around, and be sure to follow any instructions you may have received about your exam. Don't be afraid to ask the examiner what will happen during your exam. For the most part, the examiner may ask you a series of questions about your condition, like how it affects your daily life and job, current medications, and any treatments or surgeries you've had. The examiner is asking you specific questions for a reason. They relate to what's in your file and VA's rating criteria. Answer the questions as best you can. The examiner may also need to do a physical exam or perform a few tests. For neurological exams, be prepared for the examiner to potentially check your reflexes, senses, or memory. You may also be asked to perform simple tasks, like walking throughout a room to check your balance. Sensory tests like receiving a prick in your toe to see if you feel it, unbuttoning an article of clothing to check your hand coordination, or drawing a picture. Because you can have more than one neurological condition that you are claiming, the same tests can be used for designating the severity of multiple disabilities. In some situations, the doctor may request additional tests. If needed, a separate appointment may be scheduled for some of the tests. Be sure to let the examiner know if you feel uncomfortable or are in more pain than usual during the exam. Your safety comes first. Remember, your exam could last 15 minutes or an hour or more. But no matter how long or short it is, the examiner is getting exactly the information they need. Once your exam report is complete, it is sent to a VA rating specialist who will use it, along with other information you've submitted in your application, to rate your claim. Don't forget, examiners do not make a decision on your claim. They're one part of a larger VA team working with you to process your claim. Any specific questions about your claim should be directed to your local VA regional office or accredited veteran service officer. VA is committed to ensuring you know what happens during the claim process and that your VA claim experience goes as smoothly as possible. Have more questions about the VA claim exam? Go to the website listed here or search VA claim exam on VA's website.